Hello, my fellow Americans. You know, I have a battle plan that I want you to follow. Not because I'm some kind of a genius or guru or your boss, but because I want the best for all of us. So here it goes. But before we get into the battle plan, I need you to like this video. I need you to comment. I need you to subscribe to my YouTube page and look up Albert Turcaso, become a follower on Twitter, become a friend, and I will approve of your friend request on Facebook. And anywhere you can find Albert Turcaso, T-O-R-C-A-S-O. -O. So here goes with the battle plan. In order to make this government up by and for the people, we need to protest peacefully. We need to sign petitions. We need to protest and peacefully march during the weekdays and on the weekends, different times of the day, and affect business. So we have the peaceful element. We have the ethical element. We have the legal. If we have to sue in court as a class action lawsuit, we will. Or individually, we will. So we have peaceful, ethical, and legal. But here's the biggest and most important part, even more important than every march combined in reality, the financial is the biggest, most powerful thing that we can do. When you commit to saving, and I commit to saving, and reducing our spending by $50 a week, every single American, not just for now, but possibly for the rest of our lives, or at least until government of, by, and for the people finally comes to America. Now, when you do this, it is inherently important that you put the money in your home, your business, or a lockbox or safe in your possession somewhere where you can get to it. It cannot, must not, be in any bank, incurring interest even, any financial institution, your retirement, none of that. And you might think, well, but I can earn more money. Yes, you could. But the problem with that is it would not have the effect of taking money out of the economy. So why do we want to hurt our own economy? Why do we maybe want to hurt ourselves? Because in the short run, yeah, it's going to hurt the economy. But in the medium and long run, it will make every American, immigrant, what have you, every one of us, show Washington and every corporation and every business, and matter of fact, every educational institution, everybody on earth, really, that we Americans and the rest of the globe have the power. It is not any president, no emperor, no premier, no king, no queen, no prince, no princess, no duchess. None of those people really have the power. They have the power to do certain things, yes, but without the people and the people spending money, they have nothing. So I want you to effectively, effectively use your most powerful tool to get Donald Trump, the Republican administration, for that matter, all future administrations, whether they are Republican, Democrat, or another party, to listen to the will of the people. That means if you are an extraordinarily poor person, or maybe you're 17 working in a fast food restaurant, you will have more power than any president of any country. Because without you and you spending that money, the economy doesn't exist. There is no Walmart. There is no Sears. There's no Saks Fifth Avenue. There's no Beverly Hills. There's nothing. There's no DC. There's no Wall Street. Nothing without you and I. So when we, as American people, all of us together, decide to reduce $50 a week until they listen,
that will have more impact than all of our all of history's marches combined. Now, make no mistake, I love the fact that we're marching. The women and the anti-immigration ban. We need to keep that up. No, no, make. Excuse me. Make no mistake about it. We must continue, but we need to do an audible, like in football. We need to start doing it during the week, leaving our jobs, taking days of absence, marching on Wall Street, marching on Wall Street in the middle or early morning weekdays, causing them to not effectively not be able to do. do. There goes another booper. Causing them to not effectively do business. We do that one day, and I promise you, D.C. and the world will know. We do it one week, one month, and every person in government around the globe will listen to us. Because, again, we're taking away their money. If we blockade Wall Street by the sheer masses of people marching during the weekdays or all of big sections of Manhattan or or Washington, do you know what that would mean? They couldn't do business. Billions of dollars lost in just one day. Hundreds, maybe. Hundreds of billions. So you might say to yourself, yeah, but I can't get to D.C. I can't even bother to take a day off work. That's okay. That's where the $50 less per week comes in. You still have the power to shut down our government. If they will not do what is right, we will not accept it. You got to remember what Lincoln has said. Government uh, by and for the people. Well, it's time that the people get back our government. When we have a man in there, a Republican administration, and a Republican Congress, let's be honest about it. It's not partisan when it's the truth. When they are going and turning this authoritarian police state in and on America, that's when we as Americans have to legally, peacefully, ethically, and financially Put them in their place. You see, remember, they work for us. We don't work for them. Now, I need you to share this video. I don't care how long it is. You share it with every human being on earth. And you comment. And you like it. And you put it up on every social media outlet that you can. And not only do I want you to do that, But I want you to commit to not spending. You got to reduce by $50. I'm going to get out of here because the net's about ready to come in. So I need you to like and comment and join this revolution that is legal, peaceful, ethical, financial. And by the way, once you do this, Your life will be better. Oh, and if you're wondering, what happens if you get fired because you take these days of absence? Watch my other videos. I have your back. You see, I'm not going to leave you hanging. I don't want you to lose and suffer. I want you to win and have abundance. I am Albert Tricasso. Join this battle. It doesn't matter what you are politically. I want you to win. So share, comment, subscribe, and like. And by the way, if you have any doubt that this battle plan can work, answer yourself this question. Ask and answer your own question. When is the last time you spent money in the last three days? What did you spend? And where? You have more power in your purse, in your wallet, in your pocket, on your debit card or credit card 
that every president of the United States, you have way more power than they ever have. So start taking that power. Comment, like, share, and get in touch with me in real life. 412-559-2731. I will not answer blocked or private calls. Be a patriot. Get that courage. And we're going to talk.